Hey everybody, it's Scott from SCG Studios. I'm coming at you with another video today. Uh, in this video, I wanted to show you specifically how to process a spoken word recording from a pastor or just a live presenter who was mic'd with a mic with a lapel mic clipped low on a shirt, uh, like you see here. Um, so this is again from Fellowship Bible Church. This is Aaron Treadway uh, from this week's video. This week is Mother's Day, and. Uh, this is, I downloaded the, the fully complete video. This is what is going out um, to the world for the premiere. And uh, I don't actually touch the audio before it is premiered. I do it after the fact. I This is what I'm doing for the podcast release. So, um, unfortunately, it sounds like this for the premiere. How moms seem to just love to throw stuff away. But the podcast is going to sound like this. Away. Have you noticed this? See, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's a global phenomenon. It's this. So it sounds way better to me. Um, let me show you what I did. So first problem when you're miking like this, when you've got a low lapel mic like that, is you're not going to pick up a lot of the high end in his voice. You're going to get a lot of low end, a lot of rumble. Um, so my EQ is going to look how you might imagine it would look. I cut out a ton of low mid there. Um, until it sounded right to me. Did a little bit of a boost. Actually, I might do a little more. Um, so let me show you what this did. This one plug-in alone was pretty crazy. Moms, I, I don't know if you've ever noticed how moms seem to just love to throw stuff away. Have you noticed this? See, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's a global phenomenon. Before, it's this universal here's mom after. characteristic. And some moms, they call it... So, big difference right there. I decided to compress it a little bit. So, here's that. Decluttering. And some moms call it streamlinings. And some moms just call it organizing stuff. So, the compressor made his voice come forward a little bit. And the low end got boosted a little bit as well. So, you can... If you were to drive in the car and there's a lot of background noise already just from being on the road, you'll be able to hear his voice a lot more clear, a lot more clearly uh, in your car because the compression helps bring out the consonants in his voice. That I guess it's called syllabants. That's a weird, weird word. Um, but anyway, compression brings everything forward and makes every word that he says easier to understand. Then after that, I did a de-esser. Um, to reduce the harshness in his S's. But really, I think moms, like all moms everywhere around the whole world, they just love to... Th then after all that, I still felt like there was more problems. There are more problems. After doing the compression, I think more stuff popped up. So I decided to use another EQ. Throw our junk away. Have you noticed Cut this? out this guy here. So let me give you a quick example. So you can hear that. Growing That's up, a bad I frequency there. a best friend and his... I felt like he had some high mid buildup as well, kind of like he was talking into his hand, kind of like that. So I reduced these frequencies up here, markers five and four, did another shelf boost because um, it still felt like there wasn't enough presence in his voice, so I boosted that. I felt like there was a, kind of an annoying thing happening up here, so I dipped at number six. And, uh, whoa, hi. <laughs> I picked a weird way to, weird spot to pause it. Um, His name was Eric. But and yeah, Eric and I, we that's both everything I did. And we were both competitive. Here's before. Like, really, probably overly competitive. Here's that. And so when we're seven years old, Eric and I, we decide to make this. So his voice is done. I think that sounds really good to me. And uh, I'm going to put a limiter on this bad boy and I'm going to export it. And that's going to be the podcast. So hope this uh, was helpful to you. I know in this crazy time with the coronavirus, everyone's quarantined. Lots of churches are doing these um, pre-recorded videos and they're premiering them online every Sunday. So you might have to deal with a lot of miking using this technique with the lapel mic on the shirt. So if you do that, this is what I recommend doing. Some heavy EQ, get rid of the low mid crud. Compress it a little bit if you want. You don't have to. Uh, the limiter itself will do that for you. Um, and uh, use a de -esser. So those are just some basics, some basic moves to help you get a much more clear sounding podcast. Um, so yeah, hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.